Hello my sweeties, welcome back to my channel and if you're new my name is Paulette. I post twice a week. I post a little bit of everything. I post about fashion, beauty, skincare, unboxing, a little bit of everything. So, so I would love for you to become part of my sweet squad family if by subscribing to my channel. So as you saw in the title, today I have a fun video for you and it is the Sheen haul. So I don't know about you but I was a little bit skeptical about shopping at Sheen because I was like oh my goodness this is too good to be true. So if you want to see my first impression, then click over here and I will show you that video. But this is my second time shopping at Sheen. And let me tell you, it has been, mm, ever since I last shopped and I did that video haul, it, was, it has been a little bit over a year. So I thought, you know what, I am due for my Sheen haul, which let me tell you, I do love shopping at Sheen because in my first haul, I think I got a lot of um, hits and a few misses, so I was happy, I was like, you know what, I'm going to try them again, and here we are today, I'm sharing what I got, and give you the lowdown on quality, did it look like the same as the picture, um, how was the fit, all that good stuff, so if you want to know my Sheen haul, then keep on watching. So this is actually one of the tops that I purchased, and um... This is actually a very lightweight material. It has like rolled cuffs and it is very, very simple, but Definitely. you can dress it up depending on what you're wearing. You can wear them with slacks. Today I'm wearing them with shorts. You can wear them with like jeans and maybe some nice matching pumps that are like cheetah print. And I think that would look absolutely cute. It is, however, very see-through. So I am wearing an undershirt, otherwise you can see everything. And um, it doesn't feel like very like tight. It's kind of loose, but not too loose. I did end up getting most of my tops medium size. And so I feel like the fit is spot on for some of them. There were some misses, which I will show you towards the end. But most of my tops are medium size. And I do feel like the fit is there. As far as stretchiness, there is no stretchiness. So when you are thinking about purchasing this particular top or something similar to this, you might want to consider looking at the chart and you might want to either size up a little bit if you feel like you need that stretch. For me personally, I'm like, oh, okay, I think I could do with the medium and I was happy with it and I feel like it fits right on. So, and I feel like that is top number one. And again, in the screen, I will display how much each item was. So they do offer a lot of discounts depending on how much you buy. Sometimes you get like 10% depending on the day. They have a lot of sales and they did offer free shipping, which I love that about Sheen. And another thing that I really liked is that they ship very fast. So I did order about a week and these items arrived really fast within a week. So I am always mind blown. And again, they do come from like China. So I'm like mind blown. So their return policy is... So as long as you don't go over the 40 days, they cover the shipping of the return items. And it is very simple, just log in, click on the items that you want to return, and as long as they're not damaged or unwarned, you can go ahead and return them. However, there are certain things that you cannot return, which this time around I did order a bodysuit, and that did not fit me well. And I wanted to return it, but unfortunately, you cannot return bodysuits. So be very mindful of that if you order um, bodysuits, I believe lingerie, or like bathing suits, anything like that, you cannot return. So make sure that you do order the correct size. Now for me, I thought since most of the tops were medium, I thought I could get away with a medium bodysuit, but that was not the case. So that I'm just going to have to either give to someone or try to lose some weight, I don't know. I'll have to think about that and I absolutely yes. love it it is something that I can easily throw on and it can make me look very like put together so I do like that about that and the material is very breathable which I like so. all right so the second top is actually more dressy um, the material is still see-through and is very lightweight. It did look like the same as a picture and it was actually very, very um, cheap. Cheap as in, not cheap as in quality, but as cheap as in 
$5.98 last time I checked. So I thought that was very, very affordable. And for me, I love these for like the weekends when I want to feel more dressy. I love blouses like these. And I tend to go for the sheer material because they're more breathable. Again, I do live in AZ. So, so I do love a little bit, at least um, a quarter length of sleep right now because usually I tend to go for like sleeveless during the summer but this definitely works for me at the moment so this one I I've do love looking, it I've um, been on the hunt for like a blush blouse and I'm happy that this one is actually something that I've been wanting so check off my wish list so yes this is um, I wouldn't say look number two but this is the second item that I got and I'm gonna ask my hubs to rate this top for me because he is my cameraman today. So what do you think, babe? What do you think about this top? Oh, I do love the detail here. You do have to knot it twice, otherwise it gets undone because this material is very like slippery. So I do like the, the little detail there. And we have like two little pleats up here, which kind of, you know, makes, makes like a very fancy, elegant little detail. You can definitely wear like a small accessory and it'll look pretty poppin'. So what do you think about this top, hun? It's pretty poppin'. Pretty poppin'. I've been wanting since the first Sheen haul, which is Miss Frida Kahlo. And uh, I've been wanting this one since, whew. And so I am glad that I finally got it because they usually typically get sold out. And based on the reviews, you do want to keep it at your size. I was kind of concerned I was like, going to go for a large size, but I'm so happy that I went medium because they do run large or they run big so you want to keep that in mind if you are interested in this Frida shirt which I think it would look so nice if you had like the Frida hairdo and then like a same red lipstick that would look so pretty and um, yes and I'm a big fan of Frida as you can tell and this one's very comfortable it does stretch I would say it's like I don't know, 40% stretch. I do like the detail here, the bell sleeve, double bell sleeve. It is so chic and trendy. You can do this. <laughs> Little Hwanga style. <laughs> and um, yeah, I do like it. It is very... So yes, so this one is very comfortable. You can, again, dress it up, dress it down. It does look like the one from the picture. I feel like the quality is definitely there. Because I think the last time one of the t-shirts that I got was the quality was not there but this one is there the print is very vivid very colorful and so yes I'm excited about this one so this is top number three all right so this one I did forget to mention it is cotton so it is very comfortable and babe what do you think about this top uh it's pretty cool looking it's pretty cool looking yeah I like it yeah, okay. yeah it's pretty number four and I really gravitated towards this color that is kind of like a powdery blue and I thought it was very feminine very elegant especially because of the detail I am a sucker for lace so I love the uh, sleeve detail and I do like the fact that it is still kind of like I don't know like summery type of thing like uh, the material is a little bit stretchy and um, I think I should have gotten a large, but I think I'm okay with this size. This is a medium. This material and is breathable. It is a little stretchy. The top does look like the top from the website. And um, again, it is very affordable and I feel like it's very feminine, very dressy. You can definitely dress it up, dress it down. And yeah, this is top number four. All right, hun, what do you think about this top? Uh, that's cool. I like it. <laughs> it's just that it looks cool. I like it. I mean, 
I mean, I guess maybe we should go numbers, rating. Wait, what would you rate this, Tom? Mm, like a seven? A seven? C plus? A C. <laughs> really? 78, 79. Why? <laughs> I like it, but it's not like, I don't know. Yeah. It's pretty. <laughs> okay. It's not like wow, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. It's like you said, like everyday type of thing. Not really an everyday thing. Oh. It's more like weekends. Didn't you say office? Oh, yeah. I don't work don't at the office though. <laughs> people work at the office every day. <laughs> okay, all right. All right. This is the fifth top and this one is like the first one. It is a leopard print and um, it is also the same cut, same cut sleeve. I didn't realize it at the time when I was ordering it. Am I bummed out? A little bit. Am I like mode about it? A little bit. <laughs> Maybe because it looks like the first one. The only difference here is that the first top is more like a all over the place it is a little see-through and this one is not see -through. well it is a little bit see-through but not as much and the material is a little bit stretchy but i feel like this material is more like i don't know the kind of workout material that you kind of wear i feel like it's kind of like that um it's a little breathable but not as much as the first one it does look like the same as the picture from the website, so I'm happy about that. It's something that I will throw on every single day because it's very casual, but I feel like put together. So yeah, this is top number five. May, what do you think about this one? Uh, it's cool. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, like, me. That's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, it's pretty cool. All right, so so this is top number. I want to say six. Hopefully, I'm right. And um, this one, it's a crop top. I don't really go for crop tops. Um, in the picture, does she look like she had a crop top? Probably. Did I care at the time? Probably not. Um, I kind of gravitated towards the fact that it stripes and it is like pastel looking, very Easter like. I don't know, I liked it. I really did. But now that I see it on me, I'm not sure if I like it. It might have to go back to being returned because I honestly feel like, I don't know, kind of a little, I want to say it, clownish? I don't know. Just, 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 I don't know. I don't, yeah. I don't go for like very very what's the word very, oh, I don't go for shiny fabric material I feel like that's just a no for me and this one is kind of shiny and I think that's why I kind of don't like it I do have a shirt similar to this but it's a little bit different so I might just return this one um, I don't know what do you think should I return it should I keep it Definitely return it. Valerie doesn't even like it. <laughs> you don't like it. You don't like it. I don't like it. You don't like it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. See, I just, in my mind, I thought, oh, future videos, fun shirt. That's what I thought, honestly. That's what I, that's what I thought. But, I don't know. Probably have to return it. So. So this one is more of a very tropical, I'm going on a vacation type of thing. Um, I do like the print, however the fit is not quite there. I do plan on fixing it by adding some darts in there to create some shape in the bust area. So I'll be doing the back, that's going to definitely change the look of this. Um, 
this one is a bit shiny, but I don't mind it as much because, I don't know, the print, the color, everything, the combo just seems a little bit right. Don't mind my daughter up in here. But um, you can definitely adjust the straps to your desire um, length. So I do like that about this shirt. And this one, if you want, you can go ahead and put like a jean jacket over. You can put like a blazer. I do have like a bla blazer I can throw on and definitely amp, amp up the look. So I do like this one very much. It is ideal for summer or pre-fall up in AZ. So I do like it. And um, what do you think, babe? Mm, it's definitely hot in here. <laughs> <You're silly>. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> I am losing. Okay, so this is top number eight, and this one is very casual, very fun, very girly with the print all over. It is strawberries, and it is has a very unique and interesting fabric because there's like little distress all over. So you do have to be very careful when you are doing your laundry. You want to make sure you put in one of those um, protective little baggies that they have because you do not want this to rip. And so it is lightweight, it is breathable, it did look like the one from the, from the website and it is a little bit stretchy. I would have wished it would have been a little bit longer and it has the same rolled up cuff detail. I feel like they did a whole bunch of different um, fabrics but using the same pattern. If you know what I'm talking about, this is a whole lingo of sewing and fashion design. So I am kind of bummed out, but then again, I do really love the fabric, so that makes up for it. But yes, babe, what do you think about this one? Um, it's pretty cool. I like the little distress. You can't really tell from far away that it's no. distress. Uh, this, I mean, it's, it's like a t-shirt, right? Yeah, it's like a t-shirt, like a fun yeah, t-shirt. Yeah, yeah. Like, I'd probably wear, like, you know, those lace-up looking striped pink shoes. Yeah. Like, you were out and about, like, at the park, the museum. Um, you were very chill, laid back. Yeah, uh, so I guess this would be, like, a... 7.5 since it's a t-shirt now that i know the difference between a blouse and a t-shirt i guess this is not as fancy as I a mean, blouse it's, kind of, it's not fancy but it's unique because of the detail the fact that it has like the distress and i didn't even notice on the website that it had that oh but i actually like it it's pretty cool i like yeah, it it's like above average of your regular t-shirt. Okay. Right. So this is number seven. Actually, the previous one was number eight, so this is number nine. And this one, again, same cut, same cuff. Like I'm telling you, they did the same pattern, different fabrics, which now that I'm thinking about it, I'm a little upset, but um, the print is really cute. It is actually like little tiny black hearts, which is pretty cool. Awesome for like Valentine's Day. If you're into print, you might really like this one. And um, I like it. The material is breathable. It is a little see-through, so you might want to wear an undershirt. From the bottom, I did notice it's a little tight. Not like the other ones. The other ones were kind of like a little bit more flowy, but this one's a little tight. Um, this is a size medium, so I don't know. Maybe I should have done a little bit larger, but I do like it. I feel like, again, it is one of those, I feel like it's one of those casual dressy, and yeah. It did look like the one from the picture from the website, and um, what do you think, babe? Mm, so this is a blouse. Yes, no. Yes, no. Uh, In between. I'm not wild. I don't think you're wild either. 
I mean, I, I but feel... But I like it. I mean, like, it's cool. No, I like it, but I feel like because I had... I kind of selected the same cut without realizing. Uh-huh. I kind of went towards, like, the print. Mm-hmm. And if I, like... Right now that I'm trying them on back to back, I'm kind of like, didn't I just try this one on? Mm-hmm. But it's because of the cut, not necessarily because of the print. And that's why I'm kind of, like, over it. Yeah. Well, I mean, the, they're all different. I mean, same cut, like you said, but... <laughs> So this is actually look number 10, and I would say look because it is actually a complete look, very loungewear. Um, I've been wanting a cameo, like comfy t-shirt since a hot minute. So I was very uh, excited about this one because this one is has a little tie in the front, which I'm all about that right now. I have several tops and blouses that tie in the front. I love that detail. And I'm pairing it up with some biker shorts that um, actually feel very, very comfortable. This is something that I will probably wear around the house. Really something that you want to wear when you're at home. I'm a stay-at-home mom, so sometimes, you know, I still want to look cute and uh, very comfortable. And I think what makes this um, top especially, like, very, like, ooh, like, pretty cool is the fact that it has this cutout detail. The only issue here is probably wearing like a strapless bra right now. Kind of like put my straps on the side. It feels a little uncomfortable right now, but I would actually wear a strapless bra if I want to like make this look pop. Because otherwise, the straps do not hide um, right here. I would wish they would, but they don't. Have to wear a strapless bra, and the the material is very comfortable and it does stretch. And it definitely does look like the one from the website. And it is one of my favorites from the haul so far. And what do you think, babe? I like it. Yes? Do you like, like it as a set? Yeah. Yeah? And everything is good. Uh, I would say uh, nine? Nine. What? Holler. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right. Got a nine. Woo! All right. So this is outfit number 11. And I say outfit because... Once again, I'm pairing it with the biker shorts, pair it with some leggings, and this is such a fun print. I love how popping it is with the color, and um, definitely could wear some leggings with these, maybe some jeans. Just very loungewear, very casual, but I think what makes the top is the print, and the fact that it has all these kinds of colors. Um, make it fun with your makeup and your hair. And I like the fact that it goes to like one shoulder, kind of loose, and it's a, a golden sleeve, so it's kind of very relaxed. So this is a very fun um, top. I would definitely wear it at home, going out, running some errands, and even like, you know, hanging out because it is such a cool, fun top, and um, I love it. It is t-shirt material. It is stretchy, and it did look like the one from the picture from the website. And I think this is going to be probably my go-to, so I love it. What do you think, babe? Uh, I like it. Yeah? It's cool. It's kind of like... It's a little rusty. <laughs> sure, yeah. <laughs> There's a little... <laughs> it reminds me kind of like, I want to say like the 80s. Oh, like 90s vibes. I was going to say that. Very 90s? 90s. 90s. 90s? You know, with the headband, the girls are working out. <laughs> is that 90s? Yeah. It's yeah. Like, I want to say the 90s. I, I want to say it's like 80s. 80s? I don't know. 80s? I want to say it's 90s. It's like that show of the Goldbergs, 90s. the mom. Yes, yes. So it might even be the 70s. I don't know. No. I think it's between the 80s and the 90s. I don't know. Comment below if you know the answer, but definitely very that vibe. So working out with my dumbbells. <laughs> but yes, I really like it. I really like this one. I give it a 9. Woo! Uh, yeah. Like eight and a half. Really? You go know, from a 9 to an 8.5? <laughs> I mean, I like it, but I will go with a 9. Yeah. yeah, I like it. I like it. Like I said, it's very relaxing, very casual, very neat. It's like fun. fun. Yes! Fun. <laughs> I, like, I like it. I like it. So now we're moving on to the dresses, the fun part of this haul. And um, so this one, I have been wanting like a red striped dress, and I finally got it because I found myself a nice, cute little jean vest from the my thrifted look for less 
I, if you haven't seen any of my thrifted look for less challenges, I will link it up here. And I do have to do another separate video on the things I bought that I did not record. Kind of like a thrifted haul. But yes, I intended to wear this one with that one vest that I need to show you. And um, it is a little see-through, but I am confident that with the vest, I will be able to walk and rock it like there's no tomorrow. Only rock it with some flats and sandals, some tennis shoes, very casual, very dressy. Um, it is a little dressy, very stretchy material. I am wearing some shorts because, you know, it's a little out there. But um, I do kind of keep it because, again, I'm going to wear that vest and I will definitely be wearing my shorts. So yes, so I do like this one, and it did look like the one from the picture, only I did not, I could not tell that it was see-through. Um, the material is very, like, um, lightweight, and it is breathable, and, um, what do you think, babe, about this one? I like it. You like it? Mm -hmm. Okay. So, yes. And there's this is another dress that I picked up, and I really loved it. I love the button-up detail. The buttons are not functional, they're just for decoration. The fabric feels very, like, put together. The fabric is pretty thick. I feel like it's not as see-through as the other one. I love the way that it fits. Um, it is, it goes all the way down to my ankles. It is very fitted. So if you're trying to, like, dance it out, it's going to be hard. I did try to do that in one of the parties, and it was hard. But it is doable. And I do love that it's black. You cannot go wrong with black. It is so pretty. It is uh, very versatile. You can dress it up, dress it down. I would definitely recommend this this dress. If you're going to get any of the dresses, I would recommend this one because it's, it's so comfortable. And um, also wear a jean vest or a jean jacket. And um, you can rock it during fall and summer. And I really, 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 really love this one. So what do you think, hon, about this one? I like it. Yeah. yeah, it's cool. It's pretty. It's cool. It's pretty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. So now moving on to the ones that were a miss, that were not a hit, and it is this yellow dress. And the website it looked uh, like a different yellow. Uh, this one's much brighter. Um, I feel like you can see everything, so definitely not a good look. I mean, I could probably keep it and put on the vest, but then you can definitely see that I'm wearing shorts. So I am not going to be keeping this one, unfortunately. I will be returning it. I don't feel comfortable in it. And so yeah, so this was one of the misses. I'll be right back. Another one. Alright, so this is another miss for me, um, unfortunately for the same reason that I feel like you can see through the fabric, you can see everything. Not a keeper so, for me. I do love the color. I was hoping that this was a keeper because I'm looking for um, this type of color for the fall and I thought it would, be, it would look cute with some booties and some like a jean jacket, very fall-like. But unfortunately, I will not be keeping this one because it's just so see-through. Um, in the picture of the website, it did look similar, but again, and the model, you cannot see, like, through her dress. So, I, I thought maybe, you know, possibly. So, I feel like with dresses, it's kind of tricky. With dresses, they tend to be a little bit more on the thinner side. So, I don't know if I need, like, a special undergarment, but so far, um, yeah, has been a mist with the dresses. Alright, so this is the last, um look that I have for today and well actually not a look it just it's actually a bodysuit and this one I'm actually undecided at first I thought it was a miss um I feel like maybe it could be a semi what workable um the thing about bodysuits if you purchase them um you cannot return them unfortunately so I have to keep this one so I do have to keep this one I cannot return it for whatever reason you are not allowed to return bodysuits um, I do love that it's striped. I'm a sucker for a stripe, especially because it's black and white. And I like the little detail happening here, the wrap. I feel like it's really cool. Some jeans and some boots if you want to wear it for fall. Um, it's really cute. I don't know. Um, I might have to do a little bit of pants in order to actually fit in this. This is a medium. I should have gone a large, but um, I don't know. It feels a little tight on the shoulders. 
But the material, it is stretchy, so I don't know. Might keep it. Well, I have to keep it. There's no returning it. <laughs> but yes, so this is the final look. Um, there is another one, and I'll have to use the mannequin for that one because that one fits really, really, really tight. But I do love the other one that I'm going to show you. But this is Alright, so this was unfortunately a miss for me. Not because I didn't like it. I love it, absolutely. Look at that detail on the keyhole. And the arms, the little um, ruffle, it is so beautiful. I think it is a beautiful blouse for the weekend to dress it up. Or, you know, Sunday's best. Unfortunately, why it was a miss for me is because it fit me tight. Now, this one is a medium. I should have gone a large because the fit is extremely, extremely tight. So, I'll be returning it, but I will be getting the larger one. And I love the um, the deep forest green. It is so beautiful, perfect for like the holidays. So yes, unfortunately, this will be going back. Right, so this was the end of my Sheen Try On haul. I really hope you enjoyed it. And these were actually some items that I definitely see myself wearing when I'm lounging around the house, or I'm running some errands, or like today on the weekend when I want to feel a little bit more dressy. I decided to wear the pink blush blouse. I feel like it's very feminine and I kind of dressed it up and um, I decided to do my hair a little bit more more curly and blinged it up and I'll be I'm wearing it with some jeans and some sandals and um, I really really hope you enjoyed this video and so, I guess so let me know if you liked any of these blouses let me know if you've ever shopped at Shein let me know I want to know I'm curious so yes, so I really hope you enjoyed this, and um, if you are new, I would love for you to become part of my Sweet Squad family by subscribing to my channel. And, and again, I am going to be hosting a giveaway once we hit the 500. Yay! So yes, so make sure you share, share, share. Tell your friends, your family, your neighbor, tell all your people, and we will make it happen. And I'm thinking for my giveaway, it's going to be one of my favorite subscription boxes, so you don't want to miss out. So yes, so I really hope you enjoyed it, and if you have any questions about Sheen, let me know and I will do my best to answer them, because I know that I was very skeptical at first when I heard about Sheen, but honestly, I really love Sheen. They have a lot of discounts, uh, the quality is good, considering that their prices are very low, and their shipping is always free, and they're very extremely fast at shipping. So yes, I highly recommend you to shop. Now, not everything is going to be a hit. But it's okay because you can always return your item again as long as they're not lingerie or body suits or bathing suits you can definitely return your items if things don't fit if you don't like the quality and they will cover the shipping so yes you gotta love sheen and um i don't know about you but i'm a busy mom so i don't tend to shop like physically at the mall or you know at the stores because you know with two girls in the fitting room it ain't the business so I highly recommend it if you're finding if you're trying to find an alternative I recommend Sheen so yes I really hope you enjoyed it and I will see you next time and as my daughter says a heart for you bye And I do like the cubs. The cubs. They're not cubs. I do like <laughs> your face. <laughs> What's going on? This guy is driving crazy. <laughs> so I do like. And what else can I tell you? What else can I tell you? <laughs> it's because you're doing all these faces, and I'm like, oh, what's going on? Sorry. And um, yeah, it's something that I will probably throw every single. I feel like they did a whole I feel like they Casual Very Mommy 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 Yes ma'am Yes ma'am Are you gonna call? So that was the end of my ching 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 Right there Okay Filming with the toddler. Hey, <laughs> okay, what's going on? Are you gonna fart? I'm tired. <laughs> this is the end. I know. Okay, so you definitely, you definitely, I say definitely a lot.